the only radio station that's safe for streamers to rebroadcast. No, 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 skip that one. It's not just us anymore. Wait, what? Yeah, yeah, they cleared everything. It's, it's, all, it's all good to stream. All the radio music is cleared for streaming? Damn. Why would anyone listen to us? <laughs> I don't know. Just, just, just say the call sign. KDTF. <laughs> Man, some of these advertisers really are one loopy hell ride. And when you're talking about Loopy, you got to be talking about this show. You're listening to KDTF, and I'm James Clark, host extraordinaire. The phone's blinking, and I'm all warmed up, so let's get in touch with one of the Fruit Loops that calls Edenson home. Line three, you're on DTF. You mentioned loops. Uh, yes, I did. Do you ever feel like you're stuck in a time loop? Oh, God, not another one. No, I mean it. Yeah, you know what? I do. I feel like I get crackheads like you calling into the show over and over and over, and it never ends. What do you think about that time loop? You joke, but that's exactly what I'm talking about. Of course it is. Think about it. Things never change. Th- things always change. That's entropy. It's literally like a law of the universe. Listen to me. I, I am listening, but I'm also tired of all this high-flying thought experiment shit from everyone. You can't refute what I have to say. Oh, yeah? Well, try me. Fine. Every Monday, without fail, the fire station catches on fire, and the same dude puts it out. Buildings catch fire all the time. How is that a time loop? Every Tuesday, my cat disappears. Well, your pets have a life, too. Maybe you should let them go live it. And what do you mean they keep disappearing? They come back, right? The sewer gets clogged. How would you even know? What, do you spend time in the drainage ditch? What I do with the drainage ditch on my Monday mornings is none of your goddamn business. At least I'm not stuck in that little studio for 24 hours a day. Little studio. You must not have seen our new building then. It's way nicer than we need. And it makes no logical sense. And even if I'm trapped in here, well, the joke's on you because I get to go to the break room during ads and there's a vending machine and an ice maker. You get free ice? Yeah, I get free ice. Wow. The radio business is treating you well. Oh, uh, yeah, you could say that, yeah. <laughs> I thought radio was dead. That's good to hear. A friend of mine runs a podcast. He makes something like... 30,000. Uh, wow, 30,000 a year? Jesus. A uh, month. Do you make less than $30,000 a year? Uh, no. Or, I, I don't know. Jesus, that's grim. Anyway, this is all besides my point. How can you explain the fact that every week we see the same things happening over and over and <sighs> over? I, I guess I can't, but I don't know. All these existential crisis questions that people are calling in with today are just making my head spin. Don't you even care about any of this? Aren't you worried about predestination paradoxes? What the hell are you talking about? What if you did something different this loop? Did something different? You have to get out of there, James. Break the cycle. I, get up and I leave don't, now. I don't understand. Hang up on him. Hang up, James. I don't know what you're trying to do. Right, right, that's Max, it. help me. Max isn't going to help you. Mm-hmm. He's gonna... uh, God, not again. Hi, Glenn, right? I never told you my name. You just did. Again. Look, I'm tired of explaining this to you. Where's the host? I knocked him out again with a frying pan. Stop calling here. Stop trying to get him out. I can't make any money if this moron's not in this chair taking calls. That is messed up! Maybe, but I'll hit him a thousand times if it means he never gets his long-term memory back. He can't find out. I don't want to tell you again. Back off. We'll be right back after this. Edenson, it's your lucky, lucky day. Because here at Chump USA, we've got electronics deals we can't afford for you to miss. We've got the brand new Menial Mobile Tablet. And guess what? It's a thousand dollars. And it's basically the exact same goddamn thing as the last one. If you've got too much money and not enough common sense, feel free to come on in and buy a boy-boy handheld game system for your spoiled little bastard child. And if you haven't grown up yet, buy one for yourself. We never lie about anything at all. And you can totally trust our pinky prize that we don't make commission when one of our asshole associates is able to sell you, or more likely your tech illiterate parents, a video cable that costs more than the TV you're plugging it into. Look, running an electronic store is expensive and hard, okay? Everyone's buying online now, but we've got 450 beautiful locations full of part-time workers we don't give health insurance to to think about. Our recent massive round of layoffs should in no way be construed as a sign that the company is in trouble. And how dare you people hurt us by shopping online somewhere that a sales rep won't lie to you about things. Please, for the love of God, visit your local Chump USA and let us rip you off. Chump USA. Technology is confusing. We're here to help ourselves. 